Good evening, I'm Claudine Ewing. On Thursday evening, a Chictawaga man was riding his motorcycle when a car hit him and fled the scene at Genesee and Rapin Place. The motorcyclist is identified as 44-year-old Abayami Alomo. He was rushed to ECMC and died from his injuries. Now his family is sending a message to the driver who took their loved one from them. Two in your size, Danielle Church joins us now with details. Danielle, this is tragic. It certainly is, Claudine. Just last weekend, Abayami and his five siblings were celebrating their parents' 50th wedding anniversary. Now they are devastated. They will have to bury their son and brother. This is Abayami. He was on his way home from work at the Profile Barbershop when he was hit by a driver. It happened just after 930 on Thursday. Buffalo police officials tell me they don't have anyone in custody yet. We know it's not the best quality, but take a look at this photo. Officers say they are looking for a for a dark colored four door Mercedes Benz. It will have damage to the passenger side doors and the side view mirror will be missing. O officers say the passenger side airbags may have deployed as well. A Biomi's sister Brenda says there is only one way to describe this whole experience and has a message for the driver who hit her brother. Very traumatic. It was, it was, it's devastating. So my parents, all of the, all of the siblings are devastated, even his friends. Um, are shocked. Um, and it's even more disappointing that someone would hit a person and then flee the scene. Please come forward, do, do the right thing, um, and let the family have some closure. Brenda tells me a Biomi was only a few blocks away from home when he was hit. Flowers now sit on his chair at Profile Barbershop, where he worked for more than 25 years. We'll have more on Abayami's life and the impact he had on the community, community at 11. If anyone has information, call the Buffalo Police Confidential Tip Line at 847-2255. Reporting in the studio, Danielle Church, Channel 2 News.